Hello, I hope this message finds you and your family doing well, staying healthy, and doing your part to get everyone through this very tough time in American and global history. Here in Bethlehem, we're adjusting to the new normal of social distancing while trying to maintain those all important connections to students, faculty, staff, and families that make up the Moravian College community. It's more important than ever that we look out for one another as we navigate these uncharted waters amid the COVID-19 pandemic. Like many of you, I've been touched by the stories circulating around the world that highlight the very best in humanity and demonstrate how a crisis often brings out the best in people. Generous acts like corporate, small businesses, and individual donations of food and supplies to hospital emergency rooms and their staffs, folks looking out for the elderly, their neighbors, and arranging for food and medicine deliveries, and closer to home, the messages of support that all of us here at Moravian have received from alumni, current students, and their families. This outreach from the Moravian community means more than you could ever possibly know. Please know how much I and everyone at the college truly appreciates it. Not surprisingly, I've been continually amazed by the resilience and fortitude demonstrated by our Moravian community over these past few weeks. I want to thank our students for their willingness to adapt as this situation changes on a daily, sometimes hourly basis. I want to thank our faculty for remaining steadfast in their commitment to educating our students and also adapting to the online learning environment that will help our students continue their academic progress. And last, but certainly not least, I'd like to thank the staff at Moravian College, including the facilities team, Sodexo Food Service professionals, residence life staff, and the many, many, many others here who have worked tirelessly to support our students and their families. We've been sharing daily updates with the campus community, and while there have been many sleepless nights and long conversations to grapple with the tough decisions that need to be made, the health and well-being of our students, faculty, and staff have always been at the forefront of these discussions. As you probably know by now, the college is complying with the order from Governor Tom Wolf's office issued on March 19th, and while the campus is now effectively closed, our staff and faculty are working harder than ever, albeit remotely, to support our students and keep Moravian College moving forward. I also want to take this opportunity to mention that the Moravian College annual day of giving was scheduled for March 26th. In light of current affairs, we have pivoted this campaign to a time of caring initiative. This is a time for the Moravian community to come together and show care and concern for one another. Please share a MoCo Time of Caring moment on social media and consider making a gift to our new Helping Hounds or our Seeds of Hope funds, which will provide immediate support to Moravian College students. Every day presents a new challenge, and my entire leadership team is committed to transparency and sharing information as quickly as possible. We've been posting the daily updates sent to the campus community on COVID-19 information page that can be found on moravian.edu. Upcoming decisions around the end of the semester, finals, graduation, and incoming student class activities will be shared as soon as they are finalized and available. Please continue to follow the daily updates posted on our website for the most up-to-date information. Lastly, a message to our seniors and the class of 2020. Please know you've all been top of mind for the entire leadership team as soon as this crisis began to develop around the globe. Surely no one ever envisioned the end of your time at Moravian College ending like this. And I promise you we will do everything we can to help give you the ending you so deserve. As many of our seniors have shared with us, no matter when a graduation ceremony happens, memory of their time here endures and they are forever a hound. In closing, I want to encourage everyone to practice social distancing, remember to take care of yourself and look after your family. And in the end, we will all come through this crisis stronger than ever. To my Moravian family, I say, please be well, stay safe and hound them.